Hello everybody, I'm Chaos King 1236 and I'm about to rage a lot. We're going to be doing a react video to this video called Why Hitler Wasn't Evil. And I'm probably going to get mad. As are they. From my understanding, it's going to be very inflammatory. Hopefully not try to kill ourselves. Hopefully. So let's just get started. The media and school system has told you- I'm you trying to sound like a child just, just to make you believe me. Even Churchill once said that the victors write the history books. I don't so think Churchill would like that you're using his quote to support this. Basically, the one who does the most for the community has the highest social status instead of the <laughs> one with the most money. A what does that have to do with anything? What does the Lil Wayne picture have to do with anything? Do you think Obama calls up Lil Wayne for every executive decision and says like, yo, what do you think? What do you think of this? I'm, I'm loving these images she's using, especially that beginning with that little collage. When Hitler came to power, he freed Germany from the most destructive force the world has ever known. The international oh, Jewish community. Oh, wow, that is a really racist image. Whoa, 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 whoa. Quick pause. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is this this quick pause right here. This image. Can you see it? I don't know if you can see it. Are you kidding me right now? So, I know where that picture is from. And if you're pulling pictures from from uh from where I think you're pulling it from, I think uh I think your little school project or whatever this is is kind of a little biased. I don't know. Why am I laughing more than yeah? yeah he still managed to put six million unemployed Germans. Six million. Yeah. That uh that number sounds familiar. Um. Oh right. It's also equatable to the number of people he's responsible for killing. Six million. Well, I guess it evens out, right? Love that top right one. Holy fuck. Yeah, this this seems to be like a lot of like harmless facts mixed with just a tiny bit of anti-semitism in between each like section. The Nazis also created the first environmental protection laws in history. The German in history. I'm pretty sure it's not the first in history. Look at look at this look at these random ass landscapes she pulled just from Google images. What is what do these landscapes have to do with anything? Are any of these- these aren't- these are just random ass landscapes she just pulled. Good for him. It would have done us better if he'd died from it. Are you saying he's just, he's not evil because he's a straight edge? I know plenty of people who are fucking assholes in real life and they're completely straight edge. He also strongly encouraged competitive sports among the youth and the results of- Yes, yes, he was a socialist. Socialists aren't bad. Following an agenda. Still following an agenda. Hitler loved art since he was an artist. He flunked art school. Of course, he supported artists. They drew propaganda. Nazis created the first ever jet engine. Good for them. I don't care what they made. I cared what they did. A free radio for every citizen. Ooh, free radios. Everyone, let's like this guy. He gives out radios. But you're not a citizen if you're Jewish or not white and not blonde hair, blue eyed. What about the Holocaust? What about Auschwitz? Well, I did say at the beginning of this video that victors write the history books. I am personally a Holocaust denier. It's very clear to me. Literally, credi credibility has just been lost. And I'm not even like. like Okay, you don't believe that. That's fine. That's fine if you don't believe that. I mean, I cannot believe that 2 plus 2 is not equal to 4. And, like, that's fine. That's your opinion. But you literally just kind of shoved your opinion in and sort and just Im immediately said it was fact. I don't believe that there were gas chambers and evil Nazis and all that crap. <laughs> I have a video plan in the future of why deny the Holocaust. I'm not watching that. If you want the truth right now, ask someone who lived through it. Because <laughs> they certainly say otherwise. I have links to these in the description below. Let's not look at your links. That would be great. I personally love them and highly recommend them. 
Thanks for watching, yeah, because they're. <laughs> I wonder why. I wonder why you love them so much. What the fuck is this? <sighs> oh, oh, okay. What am I looking at? Interesting. So there's things after you. Okay, now there's words. Okay, so I guess these are people he's supposed to have been helping, and that he helped. Yeah, whose fault is that? That guy is total- is, he was digging into that coffee pot. Peace. I love how there's just like this part in the left corner, like blurred. No one's, no one's doubting that he was a great leader, and by great I mean like he he was good at his job. No one's doubting that. Maybe uneducated people don't think he was good at his job, because he was fucking great at his job. You sure know how to talk. That doesn't make him... That doesn't make him not evil, though. So the amount of rage I just had was a big fat zero. Mainly because this was just too stupid to even get me mad. The justifications they give were more funny than anything. I can't... I mean... Any credibility you you had from me, then you just fuck. It's gone now. I mean, <laughs> uh, I don't really know what else to say. It's just, um, and this is nothing new. I, this isn't this isn't entirely out there or anything. People, I mean, people gen genuinely believe this. There's a, I mean, whatever. It's it's done. I'm over it. I got through it all. Yay me. So, yeah, like and subscribe, I guess. Oh, okay, now it's over. Alright, so I guess, um, now I'm gonna talk about that. Um, I guess maybe a few of them were certain points. I think while there was a little bit of research done into this, it was mostly half ass research. Like, if you supported, you presented this in any sort of, even high school level, uh, classroom. Okay, first off, kids would throw shit at you, but second off, your teachers would be absolutely appalled by the fact you, A, didn't cite your sources, B, you did not mention any specific dates, or you did not present a counter-argument. <laughs> well, maybe a little bit of a counter-argument, but just saying, oh, but for all those people who believe in the Holocaust, yeah, I think that's real and just over, uh, not real and completely over-exaggerated. No, that's not acknowledging the counterpoint and addressing it. No. Just. No. <laughs> also, um, the first to do this and the first to do that. Hitler was the first to do all these amazing things. Even if he was even, like, the first to legitimately actually do that. Dates. Times. Proof that there was no one before that had ever done this. I'm pretty sure that some of these things had been done before. Or at least attempted before. Maybe he was the first to get it actually done because of the insane amount of power he had, but I digress. In any case, just saying that he was a great guy and the community loved him doesn't mean he wasn't a murderer. <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, a lot of the most famous serial killers in history were known to be really amicable guys. Like, Ah, oh, jeez, what's that guy's name? Like, Ted Bundy or something? Everyone thought he was super great. And, personally, I've seen at least a little bit of people that I know are terrible. And I'm not going too much on this subject. But they go and they are able to deliberately manipulate people into thinking they are fantastic they do all these wonderful things maybe you know nowadays they donate blood they help feed the poor they work in soup kitchens for hitler it was you know health care and all sorts of other stuff helping cute little puppies and but that's not the main point of what you know they 
do it to make themselves look good. And yes, maybe he really did like German Shepherd puppies. Maybe he really did feel what he was doing was good. Maybe he really did think that. You know? But to completely try to gloss over things that we have historical proof for is really ignorant. And it bothers me also the lack of support for the just claiming that the Jewish people were the greatest evil that Germany had faced, and now they're also apparently the um, cause for everything bad in the world today. It's really obtuse. Like, impossibly obtuse. Like, there's no support in that. That's just like a really racist and unsupported argument. <laughs> it really, really is. Um, I understand, at least in the scheme of, of politics, that there had to be a scapegoat, just like there had to be many other scapegoats in history. Like, um, I think from... Oh, shit, I'm gonna sneeze. Maybe. Maybe. Nope. Um. <sighs> shit, I lost my train of thought. Um. Even as far as going back in the biblical sense, and it's really strange that as a pagan I am mentioning this, but the fact that Jesus was killed wasn't because they thought of anything religious, but they thought, well, he is causing an uproar, he is politically um, claiming heretical things, but he mostly disturbed the peace. Um, I think at some point Pontius Pilate was not wanting to kill him? I don't know. I'm not all that great at biblical stuff. Again, I'm not Christian, even though I seem to apparently know more um, hypocritical Bible verses. Where am I going with this? Um, where I'm going with this is... This movie's a piece of shit. <laughs> this this video is terribly put together. And maybe if there was something more concrete supporting. But so far it's just a manipulative hate speech video. And I, it kind of saddens me that people are like that. It saddens me. Very much so. So yeah. I, I guess that's my reaction. It's just like... Blah. Basically, she said, because Hitler was a socialist, we should forgive him for all these things because they never really happened. Because she says so, and a bunch of other conspiracy theorists say so. And we should believe them because they're totally of sound mind. And cut.